What's up, family? We got a story out of Houston where a guy shot two guys for catcalling his girl. Here's the backstory, as much as I know. So, you got two guys standing outside of a church's slash Chevron gas station. And they're talking to this guy that's standing by his car. Inside of the car is his girl. The argument gets heated. One of the guys start catcalling the girl. At least one of the guys start catcalling the girl. At this point, the man retrieves a gun, starts popping, he busts off six shots, and he shoots the guys in the buttocks and in the legs. Both guys survive. Now, there was a time when a guy would not try to hit on another guy's girl in his presence. It was common sense that doing such a thing could put your life in danger. I don't know where these type of dudes come from who raised them, but I'm glad they got popped up. Serves them right. It's a total violation of the code. We got to exercise restraint as men. I don't care how nice you look. I don't care what kind of beef you got going on with the dude. You violate in that type of manner, then you're really putting your life on the line. Now, I know some of y'all say, well, you know, he, he ain't have to go that far. You know, she probably messing with some dudes now. She got some other dude right now. She with, he going to go to jail and da, da, da. Let me tell y'all something. You got to stop being so damn scary all the time. Some of these dudes, scary. It's always afraid to go to jail. Scared they going to get injured. They going to get hurt. Let me tell you something. If you can't defend your woman's honor, what good are you as a man? We cannot have a society ruled by suckers and lanes. But dudes just running around and saying anything they want to and popping off anytime they want to about another man's woman or, or to another man's woman. You can't do that, man. That ain't cool. That's a total violation of the code. And I'm going to tell you something. Uh, perhaps more than defending her honor, it may have a lot to do with defending his own honor because it's totally disrespectful. I'm sure dude felt very disrespected. And he did what a normal man would have done in that situation, I do believe. I ain't mad at it. Some of these dudes need to learn some manners. Imagine if everybody's afraid to stand up and fight or defend a woman's honor or even defend themselves for their respect, their own self-dignity. If they're just if everybody was just so afraid to go to jail or get beat up or get shot or break a fingernail, that they just let all violations go to the wayside. They just, anybody violate them, they just accept it because they don't want to go to jail. They don't want to get injured. Imagine a world like that where all men would just like, you know what, anything goes, whatever you want to say, man, say what you want to say, man, just don't lock me up. Just don't send me to jail. Ooh, ooh, I, I don't want to go to jail. Ooh, I don't want to get beat up. Ooh, I don't want to get shot. I don't want to fall down and scrape my leg. I don't want to break a fingernail. Imagine a world like that. I don't want to have to imagine it. And you can't say that it couldn't happen because look at some of these other trends that have taken place and that are still going on to this day. Some of these trends you thought it was going to be in and out. Here we are 10 years later. 15 years later. And this ignorance is at an all-time high. That's one of those things I hope that never becomes commonplace, where dudes just 
disrespect a man's woman right there in front of him. You know, just totally violate. Catcalling a man's woman right I hope we never, ever just get to that point where that's something that happens frequently. I know it happens. It ain't the first time it happened. I know it happens. But I'm saying I hope we don't get to that point to where that's a thing. Because that would be very, very sad. Imagine being at a restaurant with your woman and perhaps your children. And some dudes walk by, yo, man, you know, and start saying something, you know, violate, saying, damn, ooh, man, she got a fat ooh. Man, look at those, ooh. Look at that. Like, hey, baby, what's up? Leaning all over the table. What, what? You know, at what point? Do a man stand up and defend the honor of his woman or defend himself, you know, for his own respect? At what point is it okay? I suppose when dudes started catcalling that woman in front of a man, they thought it was all sweet. Yeah, they thought he was a sucker. He's going to be disrespectful to his woman. He ain't going to do nothing. Chomp, sucker. Pop, 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 pop. Then they start trying to get somewhere. You know they was trying to get somewhere because he shot one of them in the ass. Yeah. Didn't quite turn out like they thought it would. Now, one might say the man was wrong for going that far. Perhaps. But I bet you they won't do it again. No more talk. What the talking about?